Hey guys, Mr. Mabini here, and welcome to another episode of Prison Architect Day 300. Today is Day 194, and we are looking at the kitchen after the events of Day 129. At 7 o'clock it is eating time, and only the chefs work in the kitchen. Later on there will be prisoners lending their time and efforts towards their well-being and that of their fellow inmates. At this point in time, it is the only work the prisoners receive apart from cleaning the prison. This is good as management is lacking when it comes to a warden, accountant, foreman, and office blocks. The good point is that the prisoners are only unhappy during work time. Since there is almost no work, prisoners are kept in the holding cell or in their individual cells. Don't forget guys that you can comment on any of the Prison Architect Day 200 videos and your comment will appear in the next video. Thanks. At the end of the work shift, kitchen workers move the food they have prepared into the canteen in time for dinner. It is at this time that prisoners become less dangerous as they must be on their best behaviour in order to be fed. As a matter of fact, it is well known for prisoners to escape during work hours as they become more stressed if they are not provided with anything to do. At 9 o'clock it is free time, and despite the prisoners having the next few hours to themselves, they don't seem to be as excited as prisoners were before the fire. This is because there is a lot less private cells and equipment for entertaining them. For those who aren't aware, day 129 was the day the prison burned down. It had a capacity of around 50 prisoners and enough equipment to take care of them all. At the end of the day, it is time for the money to come in as the prisoners go to bed. After the fire, we weren't even sure if the procedure would go on, but 70 days later, the prison's been repaired, and we're ready to continue. Why am I saying this in a serious matter? I'm the warden, I don't care. 